Hello everyone, in this video we will show uh, how you can install the Linux Mint into VirtualBox. So I am currently using uh, VirtualBox version 7.0. So you can also install the same version or any updated version. There is no issue with it. So what we will be doing. So first of all what you have to do, you have to just go on the Linux, Google and search for Linux Mint. And then you have to click on the first link. And here you will be getting uh, this download button just click on it so here you will have different options of uh, Linux Mint like three versions they have uh, that Mate is classical traditional this one except for CE or Cinnamon edition you can uh, click anyone so currently I have uh, installed this one Cinnamon edition so I'll be showing that that only so just click on download and then you will click on any link it will start downloading so already i have uh, uh, downloaded that file it will install a dot uh, not install it will download a dot so file so you have to come on virtual box okay so actually i just remove it i don't need it now okay so now you just click on new after that you keep the name as anything let's mean i'm giving here then i'll be selecting the iso image so this is my iso image which i'm using that is an m1 okay just click on open after that you have to just uh, click on uh, next and this vbox user uh, you can change anything you can keep it as your name itself i usually show that you will be remembering this okay next uh, guest addition will be doing okay click on next then give cpu uh, ram and processor we need to provide so i am providing currently uh 3.5 and processor also 3 to next then storage i'll be providing 80 gb around okay here also you can type just if you want 80 okay click on next finish okay now just click on this uh, start button it will take some time to boot up okay so just um, maximize this window uh okay this pop-up is coming okay no issues again you have to just select the same uh same on that uh, iso file okay and just click on this uh, mount and hit try boot it should work okay now here we have just click enter so it will start your linux mint pm just wait okay so here you can see the screen uh, came now just double click on this install linux mint it will take a bit of time to open a dialog okay now select the language so english i will be selecting then just click on continue So we'll just click on continue continue for the for the steps as well okay i'm not going to take i will be keep the system as default if you want to play some video form then you have to click it just wait okay install now just click on continue okay continue give the username as Ayush same password Ayush and click on continue it will start copying files i will just pause the video until it is done if copying file is done so now it's uh, downloading we'll just wait it will take around eight more minutes 
So again, I'm just pausing. Okay, so installation is done and it's asking to restart. So we'll just click on restart now. Let's sweet. Okay, just click enter. Yes. So now it's booting up. Okay, so enter the password which you have set. Okay, so you will get a dialogue like this. Welcome to Linux Man, something information about this. So I don't want to just close it. Okay, so so we have finally installed Linux Man. Let's just enter anything over my okay, let's okay so everything is okay fine just one issue we have that is it's uh, resize issue so before that we have to just click on this install guest addition cd image just wait one dialog will open up okay just click on run enter the same password okay it will take us few minutes and then we need to restart our machine again so that uh, you will get a full screen of Linux Mint. Okay, now just uh, press enter and uh, let's click uh, power settings, not this one actually. We'll just do control alt tab and type reboot and let's wait okay let's enter the password okay still we are getting the same Okay, just I want to power off first. Okay, now we'll start from here. Let's wait. Still, the issue is persisting. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay, so you have to just do uh, right control F so that it will work. Uh, yeah, let's do like LS something. Yeah. Again, if we try to restart, sure that it should work now. What are the options if we have and you can also see cursor issue is there so that also we should uh, okay let's again try to install insert guest edition we have to click okay let's wait Okay, so now we'll again restart. Now it should work. Okay, so it's starting. Okay, so now it's working fine. Cool. Now let's do control alt everything. It's working fine. Now your size is also all done. 
so that's all guys so in this video so if you have any issue just uh, ask in comment section we'll just reply to that so that's it thank you so much for watching